in this video i am going to do some minor changes in how the website look like uh, i want to change the border of these element so let me inspect these and uh, so that i know what the class is here make it to little bit this side and uh, select this card and since these have border i need to remove the border so come here in our code and uh, put it here and in main.css i will remove all the borders which i don't required so first is card title border so in the card job title i will remove if there is any border so here is so i will remove this and uh, in the icons there is another border so i will remove this and uh, let me see if there is more borders here i think it should be on description so remove this also and uh, we need border on buttons so we will not remove and uh, save this and let's see how it looks okay it's look perfect but uh, the problem is we need some something on below the text and we need to change the background color of this icon section so oh, come here and uh, where is search for this card title sorry card icon so card icons and uh, let's add background color here so background color will be black rgba sorry rgb and for now choose this and let's add some opacity so if i type a then i can easily add opac opacity here so scroll down a little bit and uh, save this now let's see how it's look and uh, i think it's not that much noticeable so i can come back again to code base and make it to little more blue like and increase the opacity sorry decrease the opacity and uh, i think in the web's main website which i show you we have this of uh, black color but uh, i think this is also good this is not that bad and uh, i need to some need some text also so in the job title in the job title i can add border bottom so in the bottom there will be border so border bottom will be one pixel rgba rgb let's see if it's work save this and uh, okay let's make it rg uh, one pixel solid white and remove spaces save this and as you can see there is a line below the border sorry below this header so remove this and let's see so it's look perfect and uh, i think we have done enough work also we need to change this to placeholder because this is not uh, how we want so i will come to index.html and search for search content search box and in the search box i can use 
basically i need to use a input section here so let me see actually i have added the styling to this filter text class so let me see if it if it's possible to add a filter section Sorry, fil not filter section, but input field, and type equal to text, and play placeholder will be filter by search. And, uh, Okay, just remove this. And just leave it as it is. We will change that later. So, and I need to change the color of this find job also. So, the search button which is in the header dot CSS. search for this button where is it is filter okay find job button and when user hover over this button then there should be change in the color so background color will be let's copy this color i just want to make it make a little bit lighter so copy and uh, increase the opacity and change it to more lighter okay save this and let's see how it's look okay now it's look perfect and i i can also add border here so border border will be Two pixel solid. Okay, now it's look perfect. And let's see what are the changes we can do in this. So I can remove unnecessary card tag from here from index.html. Click here and remove these card unnecessary cards i don't need these cards and three cards here so add a little bit more four five six seven okay remove this okay these six cards are enough and uh, and the, we also need to change this so you can apply this same hour effect over these button which are apply and detail by adding some transition and transform scale property so that's how it's work and uh, for job we can change the url so if somebody click on the job i can type like uh, search for this where it is so here is the logo and i can try to use href here so a tag href and cut here from and paste it here save this and now i can click on this icon and i will be redirected to home okay so this is how it's work and i think uh, this is enough for this video and 
in the next video we will be doing dealing with the javascript so thanks for watching and see you in the next video